between football and losing my social life. What's the, you know, what what have you what have you really gone out and hunted? What's the strangest thing you were hunting? The strangest thing, uh, vole hunting. Uh, vole is a little field rat that is fat and like six inches long, and the tail is like that long. Uh, we used to, in the, the farm I used to have down in Amboy, where I used to live, we had a field that had thousands of them, and when we'd cut the hay every year, you could see them just freaking out everywhere. So me and my buddy down there, we'd be a couple of arses, and we'd get the tractor out, and uh, someone would sit on the back with a rifle, and the driver would have a revolver, and we'd drive around with the mower on and we just sit there shooting at them and uh, we actually got the ASPCA called on us because of suspicious activity and he thought yeah but there many of many of old met his end to us Did they tell you you had to stop then or no he he honestly he just asked what the hell we were doing and <laughs> said well if you really want to know we're killing field rats <laughs> man he thought it was pretty funny and left what would you go hunting for with uh, Trey if you took him out and what would you show him if I took him, if I was gonna show him, boy, I would probably, ooh, I'd probably take him uh, pigeon hunting. Let me tell you, pigeon hunting is fun as yeah, it's fun. Pigeon hunting, I'd, p- pigeons are stupid. Pigeons are really, really, really stupid. And uh, what you do is you get a bunch of decoys out and you sit by like a grain tower or something on someone's farm that hates pigeons. You have a couple decoys out there and some feed, and you wait. They come and they fly in, and they just blast the daylights out of them. And every now and then, one it starts freaking out and doesn't know what's going on, so he's just flying back and forth. And there's like 12 people trying to blow the daylights out of this pigeon. So out here with all the geese flying around and stuff, mm-hmm. do you ever get any ideas? Uh, multiple, but I've yet to act on them. As you know, I'm told this particular area is very, uh, God, how 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 would we say, very uh, positive towards said occurrences <laughs> you know, I'm told that uh, hunting geese on campus would be a poor idea so you know I just yeah, I just I just drool as I watch the very very plump delicious looking geese fly by I hate to take you away from shooting but uh, how about year two for football what are your goals in spring and, and as an individual and the whole offensive line uh, myself personally you know, it's the same old same. I just want to get better at my job. You know, the better I am at my job, the easier the quarterback's and tailback's life is, the easier it is on the guard and the tight end, and it easy, the better they can be at their jobs. So the less they have to worry about me, the better they can get. Uh, team-wise, really the same. Just improve, get better, you know. It's uh, trying to build off of what we had last year, start over from scratch, and move forward. It's a little early, but does Coach Huff get you guys and you get him yet? We're working on it, yeah, you know, it's still a little bit of new coaching stuff, you know, but uh, I foresee a very positive relationship, you know, I think we're all uh, really, really liking him and, you know, we're all really starting to try and bond with him and stuff, and I foresee a very positive relationship. How's it different? Uh, Just different coaching styles, you know, Uh, he's very, um, very loud and like very upbeat, very, um, uh, very funny, very comical and stuff. So he, you know, he'll, he'll critique and then crack a joke and then critique you five more times and then crack another joke or something where, uh, previously, you know, it was just a real, uh, real calm, like kind of, um, methodical, uh, coaching and kind of teaching, you know, stuff. And it's just, I don't know, it's, um, uh, just different. It's different. Coach would like to keep you in trade tackles for now. Would you like to move around and be a utility guy like Kirkland is? Uh, personally, no. I like tackle. I'll, I'm good to just stick where I'm at, unless unless he wants me to. I mean, we're we, we're supposed to know everyone else's job anyway, so I suppose you know what happens happens. So till <laughs> till he says so, I really want to stay where I'm at personally.